squat, even if I'm just squatting wraps and I'm warming up, it's just like the knee sleeves are pretty helpful. I think people, you know, regard them like they don't really give you much, much help. Maybe in carryover. But I think the nice thing with the knee sleeves is, I mean, besides just keeping a little compression, if you get a better, you get a better like feel for your uh, depth and stuff. You get a better feel for your, you know, knee positioning. I think that's the biggest thing. So it can just help you kind of get a better feel for your like. So really on a skill level, it's kind of helpful. Pretty much wear these whenever I squat, unless I'm going to wrap up with knee wraps. So. Okay. Yeah, sometimes, sometimes I do. Okay. I did that for one uh, training training cycle for me. Okay. I kind of thought, all right, I'm going to overload, overload the weights by you know, using the knee wraps. That'll help me to... Just put more weight across my chest and basically overload the upper back. And I figured that would really help. And I think for as far as that carries over to, to deadlifting and squatting, for deadlifting, that carries over great when you get that much weight in a front squat. Obviously, you're taking a little bit of the, uh, the challenge out of your quads when you can assist them. But like I said, loading up that much weight in your upper back makes you very, very strong. So. Okay. And are the socks you're wearing now, they even affect the socks at all? Or those are regular socks? Nah, I just wear these. Mainly when I deadlift, but they're comfortable okay. when I squat too. They're thin, so you know, like cushion and read. That's the, that's the main thing. Yeah. Uh, it sucks. Yeah, this is a big one. Uh, I haven't worn anything but but like solid shoes, solid heel shoes, especially the uh, squat shoes since I was in college. Uh, so these are the, the shoes I've been wearing for the last meet. They're just the Olympic shoes. Henley, New Way. They're pretty much a knockoff of the Nikes that are out there. <laughs> yeah. And are these the same? So they've got like a little bit of a heel, bottom is super solid, so okay. you know, there's, no, there's no cushion underneath, you get a really solid feel. The heel makes it easier to hit depth and keep the weight right centered in your thighs. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Recently I started wearing these. I put these more like on my shins around the calves. Okay, and what's that help with? <laughs> this just gives me a little compression. Sometimes when I squat deep, I think my hamstrings and calves kind of compress into each other and it puts a lot of pressure on my, uh, my skinny calves. <laughs> so I get a little bit of pain in the shins sometimes. So this just helps a little bit of support on the calves. I guess recently just been shirtless. I mean, I get a good feel for the bar that way, so. T-shirts are fine, it's just, if the shirt gets sweaty, it's like, that makes me feel like the bars have a better chance to slip off my, my shoulders in my front squat. I mean, for a back squat, definitely wearing a T-shirt. The bar, the bar has a ton of knurling, so. <laughs> Anything else we should know about your accessories for front squats? That's pretty good. <laughs> 